Yo, what's up guys? Coming at you with the 21 Hut video. Coming at you with a brand new event here. Very, very cool cards. We're getting into the Halloween character items. Yeah, so make sure to stay tuned. Make sure to give a video a like if you guys do go ahead and enjoy. And we're going to be getting right into it. So getting into it here, we got Henrik Zetterberg. 81 overall. He's a sentiment. 6 foot. 197 pounds. With the synergies activated, he's a pretty decent card. Uh, you know, nice low end card. I'm gonna have to give him a buy for this one. You know, 84 speed, 81 endurance, a decent shot. Yeah, it's a buy for me. All right, looking at O'Neilson now, uh, 81 overall, 6'8, 6'7, 225 pounds. Speed's a 79, doesn't have the greatest shot. It's a pass for me. All right, now looking at Marion Hossa, uh, so 6'1, 181 overall, 207 pounds with the synergies activated. Uh, decent shot. His speed's an 83. Um, you know, not the not the ama not the best card, but you know, you could always put him on that fourth line. But yeah, gonna have to go with a pass on this one. All right, now looking at Adam Fox, 82 overall. He's a right D, 5'11, 181, 181 pounds. Uh, yeah, this is a pretty solid card. Uh, pretty good shot there, and 84 speed with the synergies activated. So yeah, this is a buy for me. A really good low end uh, defenseman. All right, now looking at Zedano Char, 82 overall, 6'9", 250 pounds. Uh, looking at this with the synergies activated, he's a bit better, you know, endurance and balance there is looking pretty good. Uh, speed's a 78, and shot is not very good. So, yeah, going to have to go with pass on this one. Now looking at Jeff Carter, uh, 82 overall, he's a sentiment, 6'3", 270 pounds with the synergies activated. He's looking a lot better with a uh, much better shot there, good speed. And agility there is getting an 86 overall. So yeah, this is a buy for me. Uh, pretty, you know, maybe a decent fourth line sentiment, third line sentiment if you're just starting off in hut. All right, now looking at Kevin Hayes, 83 overall. He's a sentiment, a 6'3", a 6'5", 217 pounds. Uh, with the series activated, he doesn't upgrade his stats too much, but he does get that upgrade on his strength to 90 overall. And yeah, this is a pretty solid card coming at 6'5". Uh, speed's only an 83 though, so it's lacking. And I'm going to have to go with a pass on this one. But if you put him with another defenseman that's fast, I would recommend this. Alright, now looking at Rensky, uh, 84 overall, 6'2", 29 pounds. Uh, with the series activated, his shot it bumps up to an 88 uh, wrist shot power and then his speed bumps up to an 87 which is a lot but if he can't get that synergy activated I would have to go with a pass on this one all right now looking at Anders Lee uh, 84 overall 6'3 231 pounds uh, with the synergy activated uh, his shots looking decent but his speed is pretty bad there at 81 and yeah I would not recommend him all right, now looking at uh, Ranford, uh, so 85 overall there. Uh, he's a goalie, uh, you know, could be could be iffy, could, you know, could be good, could be bad. Um, you know, stats are not looking terrible, but uh, coming at 5'11 might be a bit might be a bit too short there. I'm not too sure. Uh, goalies are goalies are pretty weird every every uh, game. All right, now looking at Curtis Joseph, another goalie here, 85 overall, 5'11, 190 pounds. I would actually recommend the, um, Redford instead of uh, Curtis Joseph here. It just has a bit better stats, I think. And I, uh, yeah, wouldn't, wouldn't recommend uh, Curtis Joseph there. All right, now getting into Ron Hexall. So 6'3", 25 pounds. Uh, now this is looking better than all of them here. Uh, yeah, he's pretty decent stats at 6'3", too. And uh, yeah, I'm seeing, some, uh, I'm seeing some 87 overalls there. And yeah, he's looking pretty good. All right, now looking at Connor Hellebuck, another goalie. Uh, looking at uh, 6'4", uh, 27 pounds. Uh, stats are pretty good. Have not tried a Hellebuck card this year, so I'm not too, too sure. All right, now looking at, at, looking at uh, Burke. So 85 overall, 6'4", 211 pounds. Um, glove high is 86. Uh, this, is a, this is a decent card. Speed is an 84. Uh, yeah, could be, could be decent. Um... Goalies are really um, iffy this year, but uh, yeah, at 6'4", he could be could be pretty good. All right, now looking at Steven Stamkos, 86 overall, 6'1", 194 pounds. This is a very good card. Uh, he's has the Howitzer uh, synergy, which is a very very good um, shooting. Gets bump shooting gets bumped up a lot. Uh, speed gets bumped up to a 92. Yeah, this is a great card. All right, now looking at Mitch Marner. 
Uh, so 86 overall, 6 foot 170 pounds. Uh, yeah, another pretty solid card here. Um, Sean is pretty good. And his speed's an 87, agility is 94. Yeah, this is a pretty uh, decent card. All right, now looking at Patrick Kane, 86 overall, 5'11", 177 pounds. With the Sooners activated, his um, shots are pretty good there. Uh, Deking is a 98, speed's an 86. This is a pretty good card. Uh, yeah, would recommend. All right, now looking at John, John Gibson. Uh, so 6'3", 207 pounds. I've heard Gibson cards have been pretty decent this year. So yeah, you're going to have to go with a buy on that one. And now looking at um, 88 overall here, uh, 6'2", 198 pounds, He's, he has the workhorse uh, synergy there, and his uh, endurance uh, balance and uh, acceleration is getting bumped up there, speed's only an 83, which is lacking, but shot is pretty good, once again, if you put him with a fast, uh, another fast defender, he would do pretty good, and uh, yeah, it just kind of balances all out. Alright, now looking at Flurry here, um, so... 88 overall right wing, a 5'6", 182 pounds. Uh, yeah, this is a pretty good card with the Sinjas activated. He's getting that bump on the slap shot accuracy. 88 overall speed. Um, shot's pretty good. Endurance is 94. Overall, pretty good card. All right, now getting into the big boys here. Stay tuned. Now looking at an 89 overall uh, goaltender here, 6'3", 215 pounds, uh, looking very, very good stats here, could be one of the best goalies in the game, and the best goalie out of this event to, uh, for sure, yeah, very good stats there, he's probably going to be very expensive, and he is going to be a pretty good card. Now looking at an 89 overall card here, um, we got a left wing, 5'11", uh, 178 pounds, with the synergy activated. Shooting is very, very good. Speed's an 89. His agility is getting upgraded to a 99. Uh, yeah, this is a very, very good card. Would recommend. Also, the designs on these cards are so cool. Like the wizard, uh, uh, the sharpshooter. Just, yeah, really, really cool designs there. And, uh, all right, now looking at, uh, so 89 overall, right? The 6'6", 230 pounds. With this soon as activated, probably going to be one of the best def right defend uh, defenders in the game. I mean, you know, 99 overall stats there. Uh, 84 speed, which is huge. Uh, but again, if you pair him with a, a speedy defender, he would do a pretty good for you. And yeah, just other than that, this is a great card. Alright, now looking at an 89 overall sentiment. 6'3", 204 pounds, 88 speed uh, with the synergies activated. Agility is 98. Uh, yeah, overall, I think this is a you know pretty good card here. Shot is very, very good. Um, you know, speed is lagging there with only an 85, but if you get those synergies activated, it's an 88, which is huge. Um, you know, big sentiment there. Alright, now looking at Zach Cassian, the beast. Um, 89 overall right wing, 6'3", 29 pounds. Uh, yeah, this is a solid card. Um, could be one of the one of the wor maybe one of the worst ones, but uh, you know shooting's good there. Speed is an 85. Um, you know his stats all looking good. You know body checking and strength is all 99 overall. Uh, with the series activated, this is a pretty good card, and you know would recommend. Um, his shot's good. All, those, all the stats are looking good. So, yeah, I would recommend this card. And now looking at the John Carson. This is going to be an absolute unit. 89 overall right D. Um, 6'3", 218 pounds. With the Sinjis activated, he's getting 88 overall and then bumped up to a 91. Uh, his shooting's very good. This is an absolute beast and very, very good card. All right, now we just got the upgraded versions for these cards, so 90 overall, which you could only do in sets. So yeah, we kind of get the more gold look on them, which is pretty cool. And yeah, they basically have the same uh, stats uh, overall, just a bit better. And yeah, now we're going to be getting into a little mini pack opening, so make sure to stay tuned. And I hope you guys are enjoying this video. So we're going to be getting into the pack opening here. I'm actually 200 points away from getting the untradeable Halloween uh, character starter pack. And you get guaranteed a Halloween player item. So yeah, I can't get that. But I will be getting the 800 pack here. Halloween Goblin pack. Uh, 40k coins, 30 items, uh, 800 points. And we're going to be getting into this. It's yes, continue. And yeah, hopefully we do put some good. Um, you know, 81 overall, maybe... Uh, 83 is definitely a win. Um, you know, anything like that. 
would be um would be very huge. Wouldn't even be mad. Wouldn't even be mad if I don't get anything. But uh wasn't expecting anything amazing. Uh eighty nothing nothing insane here. Come on. Eighty six overall dry sidle. What the fuck? I could I could actually sell him. That is an amazing pull. I'm not wow, okay. I was not expecting that. Wow. Okay. That is a success then. Wow, okay, which I, oh, I already have them, but I'm going to sell this card, obviously, and I could make some pretty decent coins off of them. As you can see there, I have 42k there, and uh, I could probably maybe sell them for 40k, which is pretty good, and that is a good pull. That is, I, I would call that a success for sure. That was a very good uh, use of that 800 points there. Thanks for watching the video, everyone. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to give it a like, hit the subscribe button. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. And if you guys do want a, a really good Instagram and to stay updated on all the NHL 21 content and news, make sure to follow mine, NHL 21 Vibes. Link is in the description. I'm always posting all kinds of stuff from there. Uh, yeah, just a great way to be a part of the community. Uh, link is in the description. And make sure you do out to notify every time I upload a video. And it's been your boy, Little Worlds, signing in and out. Peace.